the TV world today, as we think about it, we believe needs a real overhaul. There's, you think about what the, the, the current MSO satellite world out there, it's been unchanged for many, many years. Um, the networks and the operators really control the experience. There's not a lot of personalization, maybe some personalization in the VOD catalog, but uh, for the most part, it truly is a, a lean back and, and uh, hope to DVR the right show at the right time so that you can go back and watch it. Of course, TV Everywhere solves some of that. Then we enter this, uh, the, the new TV world space, and, and these are really the OVPs and the, um, uh, the virtual MVPDs out there. So we've got, we've got a lot of capabilities around recommendations, collaborative recommendations, better, better access to finding content, but we're still out there searching for content. It's, it's, and, and there's limited personalization. It's still either that somewhat lean back experience or it's paging through screens and screens trying to find exactly what you want to watch if it's not something that you DVR'd or captured. So we believe that there's a huge need out there today to move to what we call next gen TV. So Next Gen TV isn't a new platform, it's really about a new experience. It's about an experience that can transcend across these current platforms out there and most, most importantly, we believe will revolutionize the old TV space. We'll talk about what we're doing uh, with Uyala, Microsoft in the AI space to create an effortless experience. We're using a AI to curate our channels as I mentioned earlier we will create a uniquely personalized experience. <clears throat> so if we think about the old TV, well, I'm sorry, the new TV world and this next gen TV world, the, old, the, the new TV world is really still at a recommendation-based system for discovering content and presenting what we call today personalized experiences, right? So the recommendations, it's the act of saying, that something is good and deserves to be chosen. Now there's a lot of different algorithms out there today that are used to achieve this, right? Popularity type algorithms, recommending the most popular thing, uh, identifying similar, um, identifying similar uh, items, item base type, so forth, collaborative filtering, predicting what, what a user might want based on a collection of preferences or tastes from, from a broader set of users. But now, so that all worked pretty well, and, and we all get reasonably good recommendations from, from uh, the various sites that we use. But we need to move to the next level, to that next level, that, pers that truly personalized experience. And we believe that in order to do that, we can take machine learning, and we can couple that with recommendations, and we get what will ultimately be a uniquely personalized experience.